Hello guys, welcome back to the Eastbourne Fisherman. Yay! Yeah, I've got the whole gang with me today. <laughs> I've got uh, Orla, Olivia and Harry over there. And we're going to have a fish, aren't we, for a couple of hours. Yeah! Yeah, so we've also got some colouring pencils. They're going to colour some stones and just have a you know, good, yeah. good laugh. Good. So, do you want to tell everybody what baits we've got then? So I'll hold up the bait. We've got so we've got this one here. Lug worm. Lug worms. Got fresh lug worm. Squid, squid. No, this, yeah, what, this one is razor fish. Razor fish. So we've got razor, razor fish, fish there. Okay, we we'll use that for tipping off. And more worms. We've got some uh, older lug worm. Older and that's it. So we're just going to have a fish and uh, have a play around. Yay! The weather's not too bad at the moment, actually. It's a little bit blowy. Um, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to use a two hook clip down rig and just put it out of distance with a yellow grip lead. And I uh, hope for the best. So um, we'll keep you updated and let you know how we get on. Ready to fish? Yeah! Let's rock and roll! Right, guys. So, like we said, then we've got the, uh, the yellow grip lead there. That's going to be our saviour today, hopefully. To hold us in the uh, in the tide small size two camazan hooks uh, absolutely brilliant hooks and what i'm going to do is i'm just going to take the uh, the lug pinch the tail off i'm just going to go a whole lug on each hook and just throw that out there at distance and see what we can get i've sent the kids off to find me some stones and some other like little beach bits and pieces so hopefully they'll come back in a minute oh hello, hello. there's one here it's harry's back here already so i'm just showing him what to do so the first lug worm is on the hook there Back Everyone's back. <laughs> yeah. And uh, we're just going to take the. Well, so what I'm going to do, kids? I'm just going to take the yeah. the tail off the worm. Okay, just okay. pull the tail off the worm like that. Okay. And then I'm just going to get the hook. And I'm going to feed that tail onto the hook, yeah, like that. Like I do like your shaft. Do you like cool. my shaft? That's really good. You show everybody in a minute. Oh, right. Yeah. I'm making a door. So what Wait, I'm doing is I'm just putting this on here, like that. Okay. And then when we get down to the head, we're just going to leave a little bit of worm sticking out the bottom. Like that, and then that's our worm kids, all right? Right, so just to keep the time at bay, the kids have been colouring some stones. Let's have a look what we've got then. So we've got one there. That's a little uh, seaside scene. And I'm still finishing off my other one. Still finishing off the other one. I don't know what that quite is, but it's, you know, it's cool. Olivia's done a shell. There we go. Harry, and the other one. Harry's done, what have you done? And this shell. And that side there. Harry's doing another shell. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cast it the baits out. I love fishing. It says I love fishing. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? All right, happy days. We've got a winner. It's for daddy. Is it for me? Oh, cheers. Yeah. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cast the baits out and then I'm going to uh, play with the kids and uh, I'll keep you updated and let you know when we catch anything. Right, guys, so the uh, the rod is out. We're only using one rod today. Um, like I said, just as I come down for a couple of hours with the kids. Hello. Hello. You all right? Yeah. What are you up to? Colouring the stones. Oh, that's cool. Still colouring the stones. Right then, so let's say the one, the first rod's out um, and we're going to just... Oh, there's another face. I'm just going to let... Let's see what happens. See what happens. Right then, guys. So we're into our first fish. Uh, Olivia wound it in, but she doesn't want to hold it. <laughs> so all is holding it. What is it all? It's a... Oh! It's a flat... It's a small pouting. Whoa, it's a flipper. It's a sizable one. Here you go. Barry. Barry? Barry the fish. Barry! Right. His size Barry. boy is coming in at 18. So, um, uh, yeah, she gets the truth. So, well Barry. done, Olivia. Barry. Barry, you want to call it Barry, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Barry. Barry the fish. Barry. 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 Barry Scott. Barry Scott. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, there's, there Barry he is. Johnson. There he is. 18 centimeters on the, on the ruler there. What we're going to do is we're going to get him back in, bait up again, yeah. and then hopefully try and get some more fish. Yeah. Right guys, so first fish is in the bag, uh, a sizable pouting. So uh, let's hope we can pull a couple more fish out today for the kids and uh, see what happens, eh? Yeah? One little farm, two little farms, woo! <laughs> Ready to rumble. Right guys, so the kids are into the next fish. This one's Harry's, so well done Harry. Uh, it's a small bass. It's Gerald. So a little miniature bass, Gerald. 18 centimetres that one's coming out at. His name is Gerald. Guys. His name is Gerald, guys. His name is Gerald. So I think the game today is name the fish. So we've got one small pout, and one miniature bass. All we need to do now is find his dad or mum, and then we've got some dinner. Woo! No! What do you mean no? I don't like eating it. Oh, okay, we'll put them back then. Right, so we're banging to another fish. All reeled this one in. So it's a whiting. It's a whiting, it's quite a nice one actually. Yeah. There he is. It's big. There he is, so well done, it's another fish on the table. So what have we had so far then? We've had pout. Um, a small bass. Yeah. And a whiting. So there we go. Yay. Let's crack on and have some more fun. Yeah. You having fun? Yeah! 
Yeah. Right, so we've done some good fishing at the moment. So what we're going to do is we're going to have a snack, got some bourbons. Yeah. yeah. Everyone likes a bourbon, don't they? Yeah. yeah. Who wants one? Me. Comment if you like Can a bourbon. Can I get Comment if you like a bourbon or what's your favourite biscuit? Two. You're going to have two. Yay! Yeah. Go on, yeah. Ow. There you go, Johnson. Yeah. Dad's going to have one as well. Mm. Dad's favourite biscuits either. These are my yeah. favourite biscuits. Absolutely brilliant. Oh, no. No, no. Right, so we've uh, come back up to the tent. It's getting a bit windy now, isn't it, mate? Yeah. Yeah, the others are still out playing, just uh, having us some fun. Um, and uh, we're just riding out. It's not a bit quiet at the moment. Uh, the high tide's in about an hour and a half, so we're going to fish it up to the high, and then maybe fish one, one hour back out. Baby, look what's going to oh, That's cool. It's a triangle. Triangle. Oh, that's cool. So, uh, are you having fun? Yeah. What fish did you catch? Um, whiting. A whiting. Olivia had a pouting. Harry had um, a bass. Harry had a small bass, didn't he? Yeah. Pretty cool. So yeah, we have one fish each at the moment. Dad's had no fish. Because <laughs> he's rubbish. Is that bad? Yeah. Is he really bad? Yeah. Oh man. Oh man, that's really bad, isn't it? <laughs> but yeah, we're going to keep going. We're going to, uh, you know, see what happens. I know there's quite a lot of lads been out over the last couple of days. Uh, and the fishing's been slightly poorer than usual. Uh, so, we will see. We will see. We're down by Eastbourne Marina Rock Arm today. So um, it's not very busy down here, it's quite quiet. Um, there's another kid fishing down close to the rock arm uh, and then uh, one behind me as well. So um, we'll see. I haven't seen them pull out any fish yet, have you? I haven't we seen any did, fish being pulled out. We so, did uh, find um, a, a yeah, dead whiting. Yeah, we did find a, someone has discarded a, a whiting which was a bit, a bit bad. So we'll get that back in the sea and hopefully that'll be used as uh, some... Okay food for some other fish so yeah let's see what happens right so we just reeled in uh, dad's just reeled in and the lid helped me so we've just come into another whiting there and uh four species of the day a place what's a place it's a it flat looks fish. like a plate it's good isn't it look you see the tail is a place it's got the orange spots on it looks like a plate it does yeah it's cool isn't it yeah what do you reckon then happy with that yeah my yeah. two fish Two fish, man. Two fish. Well, cool. Thumbs up. Yeah. Right, so we're into another Ooh, fish for Harry. Is. Harry, what is it? It's a bass, I think. No, I think it's a whiting, mate. It's a whiting. A whiting. Wow. Are you okay. All good? Yeah. Yeah. All right, cool. Big Happy days. Big right, so the kids have gone off playing. Just got a couple of minutes to myself, which is cool. Uh, yeah, so uh, I do get asked quite a lot by people, especially parents. You know, how do you keep the kids engaged when you're fishing? Um, and the best thing you can do is have three things. Colouring pencils, felt tips preferably. Just looking at the rod to make sure it's not going. Colouring, colouring pencils, felt tips, so they can draw on stones and things like that. It keeps them occupied for hours, literally hours. Um, a chocolate bar, some biscuits. Um, and yeah, and that's it. Uh, don't, don't take the computers, because they, they tend to switch focus and just stick on the computer and I, I can't get them refocused into the fishing but yeah I think they're having a good time today we'll find out a bit later on um, and it's been it's been it's been all right I mean we've had four different species so far quite a few fish and uh, you know the kids are enjoying it so that's the main thing I think the rod tip's going again so I think we might be into another fish so yeah it's going all right it's going all right we're still on the rise of the tide uh, so we think we've got about another so tip time Ugh. It's uh, 1.40, so the high tide is at 3 o'clock, I, I believe. Uh, so we're, we're doing all right. I mean, we're doing, we're doing not too bad. Uh, it'd just be nice to get, you know, a bigger specimen fish for some dinner or something like that, because I'm absolutely starving. So a nice big uh, place or, or a big, bigger bass, um, or possibly a dogfish, actually, uh, which would be quite nice. So, yeah, we'll see what, we'll see what happens. So, um, wish us luck. Right, so we're back into another couple of fish. Two white and double shot for all of them. hold it up so everyone can see. Mm. Have to come up a bit. Half of that over it. There's worms still So there's two. In there. Yeah. Still worm in there. Still worm in his mouth. He's been eating my worms, didn't he? Ooh. Yeah, he's been. You can have that one. We'll put him back in a minute. Yeah. Right then, so that is the end of the day. We've still got one rod out, uh, just on some lug with some uh, razor fish, won't it? Yeah, razor Yeah, fish. on a clip down rig. Uh, but I don't think that it's going to be any good. If we catch any more fish, we'll let you know. So you guys had a good day? Yeah. 
Right guys, so I think that's it from us. Um, so thanks very much for watching. Like and, and subscribe. Like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next adventure. Rock and roll!